Obviously, it's an extreme example. Just but. like crutches. Yeah. But, yeah. He, it's good to see somebody earnestly trying to fix their gameplay, their lifestyle, their mentality. We'll see how it pans out. Because I, I think all of the really top players in Australia, you've known exactly that they were going to be good when you saw them. I don't think... I think I've steadily improved slowly. But you still were always, like, clearly... On, like, had that ambition. Yeah. Had that, like, rate of improvement at the beginning, which yeah. I think is, I like, think everybody... You have a fast rate of improvement at the beginning, for sure. I think the only one... Maybe Fest is one where I was, like... Uh, even then, I still... I, I knew it Flora was going to be really good. But yeah, I was, nice. like... Well, it was like Everyone was saying that. I'm like, I suck right now, though. You're like, you know, I think being very humble about where you are currently yeah, oh, is huge. Dude, ben Tolson from AZ, big tip from him is the second you start thinking you're good, you suck. Yeah, dude, as that's, soon as I won, moment, man. That's the moment yeah, it's I over suck for you. instantly. I think it depends. Outside of playing, if you think, like, being hard on yourself is super important because that's how you get better. But, like, in the moment, no, I'm fucking. Like, thoughts of, like, I'm fucking sick, I'm playing so good will really help you're mentality. Sick, it's thinking, like, I can go toe to toe with this guy. Yeah. Like, I deserve to be on this stage. Yeah. I hate like to keep bringing it up, but like yesterday in like the crew battle, it's just like I'm playing really good. I'm gonna keep playing really good, you know. And then it's just like for a second I, I thought like I need to end this. Dangerous. Anytime I'm thinking like oh, I'm doing really good right now, it's like a, a mistake to me. I think feeling yourself in sets is very good. But like yeah, feeling yourself in sets is good. But think like assessing like I'm probably playing like a nine out of ten right now. This this sounds really dumb, but I have like, a. a did, were you gonna say something? Sorry? I was just gonna say yeah. Johnny for the mic. Okay, there, there we go. Yeah. Um, one moment. thing that I really like. It's like a concept, so this works for me personally. I'm not gonna say it w would work for other people. It's like a storing thoughts and like feelings. So it's like, if I feel like I'm playing well, I'm not gonna like start popping off and everything, you know? I'm just gonna be like, yeah, playing well, like good, keep that in your head. But if I like fuck up or anything like that, I'll instantly just like, one big wave, just like, sound like, fuck. And then I'm just yeah. like, all right, you know? Just go like, like, I, like a telltale sign of people tilting is going like, oh, and like stuff like that. But like, for me personally, I feel idea. fine right after it. I'm like, I let it out, you know? It happens. Right, I think it's just, it's pretty similar to the concept of like having a deep breath. Yeah, it's just like the FGC nod. It's just accepting you've been outplayed and moving on. Yeah. Or even that you made a mistake. Yeah. Speaking of being outplayed, I must get the heavy favorite going into this. Yeah, this is probably going to be brutal. Stream setup already says 1-0. Wouldn't be surprised if it happened that quickly. Just leave it there, man. Must is actually decent against Moth. Like, in terms of his like, repertoire He's of like Average skill level, yeah. Yeah. Musk is someone who like has so much potential, but he plateaued really hard. I think he's just a timid player. Yeah, he's very scared. Yeah. Doesn't go for the big money. Fighting against there, like you know? how you really, really want to play is like so like just like your. I, I've been really doing hard. that for a long time. I think uh, like reworking. You, you need to rework you almost. Yeah. Like I, I do think that we we like mirror the the way we are in the game a little bit. Yeah, obviously. I think I've definitely. I understand what you mean. I feel like I've changed my playstyle a lot. In like the last like you've changed year. your personality too really a little bit i think so i think you like as we make small changes it's easier to make changes in game when you're feeling more confident yeah i think i'm comfortable i feel confident in like something i know that like, like i've worked for you know like musket might not go for an offstage shine just because his like he doesn't personal know belief isn't McBeck. there well, i think yeah. musket will always go for these things against lemons right been in the clutch situation yeah. against somebody who doesn't know he can beat already, then it's like, it's why he's kind of been dominant in SA when I haven't been there. It's because yeah. he knows he can beat these people and he's like, he just executes what he knows. Yeah, but he just when goes he gets through into an emotions. unfamiliar situation, then he can kind of freeze up a little bit. I like that expression a lot, going through the motions. It's just like Dude, another day, another day. And that's why know? I think being a winner early on is so important. Like, think about someone like Mango, he won his first national age 15. It's like, from there, you're like, I just got to do it again. I've already farmed everybody. Like, you can go both ways. You can, you can you know, but that anytime, end up like Macaulay Culkin and. Uh, but anytime you're on the big stage from there, it's like I know Muti King. I've beaten this guy. He's yeah. not this like scary demon that's way better than you. That's true. I definitely think I approach my matches with like Spud and Sora differently as a result of having beaten them in the past. It's yeah. like, yeah, I can be that guy. Like, yeah, it's like obviously like Sora's through, level though. at the moment is like faster and like better than me. But I, yeah, I can yeah it's super doable. And like coming into a set that you're supposed to lose without like you you need to have that even if you haven't won before. Yeah, it's hard. Yeah, it is hard. But like in life like in melee, I think winning early is massive. It like changes everything. In life like in melee. Yeah, I mean being privileged is good. <laughs> but it's not even good life. <laughs> it's not even so much privilege, it's like getting positive feedback. No. Oh, big S Nash. I think knowing what the right thing to do is a lot of the times good. 
but it's like going for that Armada Shine early because you have the confidence because you think you're sick. I think it's not like more so like having experience win. It's like more so experiencing, even experiencing losing. It's just like, I don't like this, you know? Or like being able to clutch it like after losing and just going like, this isn't always going to be like this, you know? Yeah. That's also really important. I feel like we should be more match oriented. I mean, it's fucking local yeah. SA yet again. It feels like I a, knows exactly a little bit of a top player. Uh, We're having a chat. Game. I mean, what are we going to talk about? It's just like Kai knows everything this guy's going to do. Not Kai, Musket. sorry, Musket. It's just like before he like just F smash the ledge, knew he was going to rise. He's just running fear. around, throwing out attacks, and most of them are hitting. Yeah. Yeah. Right, like, like, well. when, it, when it gets to this, it's like there's not much to talk about. You know? Like, th this this level of melee is so dictated by the fact that Lemons can't kill off that situation right yeah. there. So it's like, yeah. there's not much more to say than, like, Lemons, you needed a kill there, man. You'll see it in, like, all like, pool pool's commentary. It's different with Big Cheese, because we actually have to put, like, head-to-heads, right? But, like, in, like, any pool's commentary, that's like, it's almost... Not pointless to talk about it's the match. Just it's just they're not playing. Like, it's just the mistakes like missing this, missing this, missing this. Like if yeah. you harp on it too much, you just sound like an idiot. You know. Remember the uh, the Sora Miles Arcadian commentary? Glorious. I think that was Kalen. Oh, I wasn't on that. I don't remember Kalen. Sorry, I was really drunk. <laughs> just berating people. Yeah. Yeah, we're just ruthlessly going in <laughs> and everyone. We're like, this is it, huh? And then Doc just like showed us how to play the game. Like, thanks, Doc. Yeah. <laughs> Lemon's yeah. not clean enough for the punish. Doc really has, Doc has some potential. Pressure. There's someone who might be on the come up. The worst, the most annoying thing is like when you have to tell someone like, what can I do to get better? It's like, just practice, bro. Yeah, exactly. Like, that's so annoying because like, that's not what they want to hear. But it's just, like, they want you can one say. weird tip. Yeah, honestly. Yeah, I think a thing that happens to a lot of new players or like players who are at a lower level is they want to like, really solve the like neutral game and why they're getting hit and they feel like that's like the most valuable part of the game yeah. is like they don't